Este es un vivo. Live stream. Live stream unboxing of this, the Apple TV 4K. Uh, yeah, it looks just like the old Apple TV box, except it says 4K on it. And it pops right out like that. So there you go. That is what's in the box. Um, the remote's a little tiny bit different than the old one. The 4K Apple TV looks pretty much the same as the original. Pop the cellophane off. Maybe a little weightier, you know, perceptually. Uh, but you got. Oh, yeah. I was like, there's no ports! The stuff was covering it. Hey, Scott. Uh, so you got your HDMI port, your power port, and your Ethernet port. No cable, no HDMI cable. Don't forget that if you ever get one of those. Uh, but yeah, it is pretty shiny, ain't it? Uh, here is the remote. And you can see they did a little ring around the menu button now. So it's a little easier to distinguish from the other buttons. Otherwise, it seems pretty much the same. This has to be charged like once every 6,000 years or something. It lasts forever, but you do have to charge it. Which I used, I, when I first, when they first did that, I thought this was not a great idea. But honestly, it has only ever run out of battery once uh, in my use of the other 4K Apple TVs. I think this is the power code. Xcode 9 wireless connects to this so you can sideload. Ha, ah, good tip. Yeah, this is just the power cable. What else you got in the box? Your FCC stuff. They always give you one of these uh, for charging, uh, which is nice. I'm like, would they just give you an HDMI cable too? You're gonna, I mean, like you didn't think, whatever. Anyway, uh, that's it. That's all that's in the box there. I'll pack that all back away. Now, if you'll bear with me for one moment, please. Um, I don't have anything to sit this on. I was gonna go compare the other remote. Where is it? Can I find it? Should have planned this ahead of time. But it's live, it's live, okay. So there's the old remote next to the new remote. You can tell, a little shinier uh, for sure because it's newer. And there you go. Just just pretty much that ring around the menu button. That's the difference. And now I won't get them confused. So that's it, Apple TV. Uh, yes, this is the high capacity 64 gigabyte version. I'm not sure you'd need that, especially because we found out you can't download the 4K movies anyway. Those are only streaming. Apple uh, kind of sneaked that into their online support documentation. So free upgrades of all your HD iTunes content for streaming, for streaming only. Anyway, there you go. Hope you enjoyed this unboxing of the Apple TV 4K. I'll let you know on Daily Tech News Show how it's working for me once I get it up and running. Talk to you soon.